Hello, my name is Adelina Popescu and I'm a data analyst at BT Provider. Today we will learn how to create animations in Tableau using filters and parameters. For this, we are already connected to the global superstore data source offered by Tableau. Animate visualization helps us to better highlight changing patterns in our data, reveal spikes and outliers, and see how data points cluster and separate. So, the first step that we need to do is to create a parameter named select level. From the data type, we have to select string. And from the allowable values, we have to select list. And here we have to type in the value, category, region, subcategory. segment, ship mode, state, and then click OK. Now we have to create a calculated field named level of detail field. The formula case select level when category Then category. When subcategory, then subcategory. When region, then region. When state. then state and let's see we have the ship mode when then ship mode and i think that this is all and then click OK. Now we have to create another calculated field in order to create the profit ratio. The formula sum of profit divided by sum of sales. Then click OK. So now we have to drag the sales on columns and next to it the profit, then the profit ratio then the discount. On the rows we have to drag the field select level of detail field and we have to change the visualization type to be entire view and also for the cells axis we have to drag the cells on color and also to show the mark labels. On the profit axis we have to drag the profit on colors and also to uh, show the mark label for profit and we have to repeat this step uh, for all the um, axes uh, in our visualization and click OK. Now we have to create another parameter named sort by. From the data type we have to select string and from the allowable values we have to select list and here we have to Type in all the values, all the measures that are in our visualization. So sales, profit, profit ratio, and discount. Then click OK. And now we have to create another calculated field named sort field with the formula case sort by when sales. then sum of sales when profit then sum of profit when profit ratio then profit ratio don't have to aggregate these measures because it is already already an aggregate measure 
and when discount then average of discount end and now what we have to do is to right click on the level of detailed field and select sort and for the sort by we have to select field and for the sort order descending and for the field name we have to select the level uh, sort by field sort field and then click this one now we have to create a dashboard here we have to drag a vertical container and um, into it we have to drag this worksheet bars we can remove the legend and also we can uh, add here an horizontal container edit the height and also here we have to show these two parameters select level and sort by parameter so we have to add some blanks here in order to um, minimize these parameters so let's see what happens now we can view, uh, we can view our visualization um, uh, at the category level if we are changing uh, this category level to region we can see that now we um, see the sales profit profit ratio and discount by region if you are changing it and we can see the um, level subcategory and so on also we can sort our visualization for example uh, now it is sort by sales but we can sort it by profit for example or by discount or by profit ratio so i think that this visualization is very interactive and offers us more ways to compare our data and in a single uh, dashboard we can see many many uh, type of visualization and um, i think that this is very helpful Thank you for watching guys and if you have any questions please feel free to contact us.